Okay, let me show you the room here. So we got, you got me on camera A. I'm going to walk it around. This is um, NDI, uh, Network Device Interface, in play here. So I'm going to go to camera B. That is my iPhone. All right, that's pointing at my Barista Pro. I'm going to show you how to make, I make a cup of coffee here for Kepi in a minute here. <clears throat> so that's camera B. Now I'm talking to you from my Shure MB7 mic, which is a podcasting mic. It's like the sister of the SM7B, but I like it because it has two inputs, a, a USB and an, a, and an XLR. So you can use one of the two and you can have them hooked to two different computers, which in my case, I have it hooked to my Mac and I have it hooked to my uh, PC workstation. Okay. So here we go. Here's camera C. Now this is my Dell XPS 8950, 64 gigs of memory, i7 12th gen, I believe it is, maybe 13th gen. And um, this is kind of my um, main workstation on the P in the PC environment. But you're seeing one of my screens. This is a curved 28-inch um, Samsung monitor. Then I go over here, and this is hooked to the same video card. This is a NVIDIA GTX. What is it? The 3060 Ti GTX 30 or RTX 3060 Ti. It's not the highest gamer's card, but, and I hate to, I hate to call things gamer's cards because this is just a high-end video card. Um, it's got, I think, DDR5, I think 8 gigs of DDR5. So it's pretty um, pretty intense, but you can see through NDI, I'm able to show you all these all these sources. Okay, my my uh, watch just told me my fast was completed, but I don't eat till three o'clock. So, all right, so uh, let's get back on track here. So that was camera. Is that camera D? Okay, camera E is actually my iPad. And here's my iPad. This is a, a, an older uh, second generation, but, you know, I can bring up um, touch, touch ID. All right. There we go. All right. So I can go and search around the web or whatever. Okay. Sweep that up. Okay. So that's that. Now, that was camera E. Now we go to camera F. Now, camera F. That is a good question. What is my camera F? Maybe it was my iPad mini, maybe? I don't think I have it on. That's probably the deal. Yeah, there it is. All right, there's my iPad mini, which I've got connected. Um, that's my, my little doggy Chavo. Come on, Chavo, where you at here? Okay, all right. So that's my actually my teleprompter. Um, it's a little, um, I don't know. I don't know how big these are, five inches, something like that. Okay, so that was camera F. Camera G is a Brio 4K camera. This is on my laptop over here, pointing back. Now, if you look over this shoulder here, if you look at that little light, you see it's right like right there. That is another camera, which I'm going to show you in a second. That's this one, and this is pointing back, having my second cup of Java. <clears throat> and this points you back at my whole deal here teleprompter. I've got two 28-inch 4K Samsungs. Can you tell? I like Samsung. Um, okay, so I've got those. I've got my mic right here. I've got this little thing, and this is my, um, they call it a stream deck. So I can move from Screen to screen, it basically is like a one touch for a keyboard. You can label them, you can do whatever you want. I can set my lights, I can, I can go off with my lights, I can go back on with my lights, that sort of thing. And, um, and then I could do th some pretty, I'm going to go back to my main camera, but I could do things like this. Let's see, if I want to show, I mean, I have these set up to do that. Uh, this would be my... 
screen. I don't think I have it on this one. Uh, no, I don't have it on this scene, but I can actually show you also my two screens, the two 28 inches that I showed you. And then um, here's my big thing. Now I'm going to go to my next scene on my podcast software, and this is going to turn my mic off here and enable my iPhone mic because I'm going to make Kepi a cup of coffee here. So. Here we go. Okay, now I'm going to come over here and make Kepi a cup of coffee. So let me fire this thing up. Hopefully, yeah. And yeah, lighting's pretty good in here. All right. So what I do initially is I use this little dispenser and I'm going to pour out 28 grams of coffee because that'll make a two to one pour. This is going to be a long black. So let me tear this out, tear this out, tear this out, whatever way you want to call it. I'll put my beans in here. 13 grams, somewhere between 18 and 19. And yeah, 18.8, that's good enough. Okay. Closer to 19, but that's all right. I don't leave beans in the hopper because they get stale. And I don't like to do that. So here we go. Here's a little thing that goes on top of your... Oh, that's running up right there. Okay, so then I use this tool. It's called a WGT tool. It's basically just a bunch of, you know, um, little needle, little pins that you just stir the clumps up so you don't get, you get even distribution. I probably can do without these, but I like using it. I saw a couple of videos on it. It was pretty good. Okay. Problem is don't drop it. Then you bend all the needles. Get that little tap. Open that up. See the, see the kind of, not evenly distributed. I use this distribution tool. It's got two sides. One's a tamper and one distributes. So I put it down here, go like that, spin it a couple times. Now it's a little bit more distributed. I press down. Okay. Then I use this thing to kind of keep my whole unit clean. It's called a uh, screen puck. Looks like that. I just drop it down. Boom. Okay. Like, like that and then what I do I usually have a little bit of creamer in here for Kepi but I'm gonna have to put that in after the fact so I'm gonna go ahead and tar this out now 18 grams is basically a th uh, 36 gram pour so I'm gonna start this and I'm gonna let it run until that gets up to 36 and I'm gonna stop it It's about 16, 18. When it about 32, I'll stop it because it's going to continue to pour. Okay, here we go. Eh, 37, 38. That's cl close enough. So that's, that's a pour. And then I'm just going to go with water. I'm going to take that up to about... Probably 180, and then I'll put some creamer in it. And that'll be a long black. It's a pretty good unit. I really enjoyed it. The Barista Pro. Reville makes it. Okay, so I'll make it that about 180. So there's your long black. I'll just put a little creamer in there for her, and that, that'll be your coffee. All right? Anyway, I'll come back to me over here. And let's go back to scene. Here we go. Okay. So uh, I should be back on regular speaker. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think. All right? Ciao for now.